Alrighty, folks. I think this one might be a little bit of an emotional episode. Man, I wish this wasn't... <laughs> I wish I didn't have to do this in the morning, because I'd be having a drink. Um, welcome, everybody, to Halo Master Chief Collection. Really fucking cool looking in there, by the way, in the intro here. It's music, though. It's music, though. Small update. Uh, probably he'll he sign him on for achievement. Oh! Okay, alright, see you on the battlefield. So, there's been a thing that's happened here. So we got the exchange still going on. I wanted to sit down. I have zero spark. Look at all the cool shit you can get. Man, I really was slacking in this. Uh, what is it? What do, what do we look like here for everything? Let's do some customization while I'm talking. I'm your guys. host Dakota Morgan coming from Phoenix, Arizona. Front of podcaster, animal caretaker, dinosaur enthusiast, all the shit like that. And we're here today as a remembrance episode. Uh, we I haven't played Halo Master Chief Collection in a long time. Uh, a very, very, very long time. To say the least here. Uh, dude, I am still rocking my yellow and gold, by the way. Uh, yeah, no, I've always done yellow and gold. It's kind of, like, been my thing. I don't know why, but it's always been my sparkling colors, and infinite has made it so that's fucking impossible, and it really pisses me off. But since the old days of Halo 3. But we're looking at Master Chief Collection, because the news came out a couple weeks ago now that they're not doing any updates, right? And... It really sits with me, because Master Chief Collection started, I mean, let, let's be honest here. Oh, this is, this is wild, holy shit. Um, it really, it was something else, the Master Chief Collection, right? Like, the way this is set up is very interesting, by the way. Do I not have that much in here? Huh. I don't, actually. Oh, that kind of sucks. Uh, wow, I really did not get that much on the points in here. Wow, that kind of... Hmm. Interesting. Um... Uh... Wow, I really, yeah, I really fucking... That ain't... No. That's not Halo. Get get the fuck out of here. Although that helmet is really fucking cool looking. We're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna throw it back here. We're gonna throw it back. We're gonna throw it back. Wow, look at the Halo 3 stuff in here. This I, is gonna be... Memory fucking lane here, folks. There we go. I did like the rogue one back in the day too. It is it is kinda gonna be this this memory lane going on here because they're not doing any more updates. The the updates are done. The updates are they're gonna do, they, I I know they said that there's a small update that they gave us in the beginning there for a minute, but like they're not going to add anything new to Master Chief Collection. So I wanted to take a look in here for a little bit of time. You know, we're going to play a little bit of online. I'm looking through the customization, kind of getting some throwback shit happening here. And, you know, kind of... Just remember. Oh, those are arms. Oh, we got like a really pimped out fucking one. Holy shit. Uh, I really got some really cool interest in Halo 3 updated stuff. Like, updated Halo 3 armor. Like, that's fucking cool. Right? Hey, that's fucking awesome right there. EVA. Honestly, yeah. I think I'm almost rocking like what I was back in the day. Holy shit. Honestly, I'm really feeling going old school. We'll keep the new show. We'll keep the new arms. The new arms kind of fitted a bit there. I'm feeling pretty old school with this. Back accessory. What the fuck? Uh oh, 
Oh, yeah, you could get the... Oh, there's a... Look at that little thing there! Bean117. Ah, oh, it's cute. I know there's a grunt backpack, too. Jack suit. Like, there's just so much customization that could have been done on this shit. It's fucking wild to me. All of it. There's Johnson even there, too. All the stuff they could get, like... Halo 4. Yeah. I was mean, by the way, I've been looking at Halo 4. We're gonna... I, I, I'm all over the place right now, but we're, like, we're looking at all the older Halos real quickly here. We don't really get a chance to do that too much. I'm not gonna lie. This one... I was thinking about it the other day. Like, this shit here, I really like this shit. I was also the uh, it's W. It should be W. Yeah, yeah, Halo Four armor helmets are at least pretty cool, except for these ones. When it gets weird sci-fi shit like that, it's gonna be recruit. No. Where the fuck is it? Ah, this one. I actually liked the warrior helmet. I thought the warrior helmet was actually pretty fucking cool. I don't know why I never really. I don't much love. Badass right there. So. You know, they're not making any more updates to the Halo Master Chief Collection. And... You're able to that? Oh, okay. Weird. Um... Is that... That's the crazy part about this, right? You know what? Let's do some firefight. Covenant firefight. Spartan Ops. Nah. Hmm. What do we look like for Reach? Yeah, let's do it. And... What the fuck? Oh. Uh... And, and that's the thing about it, too. Like, we know we're not... Firefight Classic... Uh... Where do we want to go? Hmm. Some of these maps are new, actually. Let's do the Firefight Classic and accept options. This is too easy because we're gonna we're gonna be talking and shit like that. So like, we're gonna do we're gonna probably do a multiplayer match as well, but. Master Chief Collection, let's look at the history real quick, right? Master Chief Collection gave us so much. And it had a rough start. It had a Fire really, fight. I remember... This sector uh, is your number one to, priority, yeah. soldier. I gotta remember the controls. I gotta remember Halo Reach controls. Frag out! Oh, that's my voice. <laughs> Little sergeant. So, like... We... It had the rough... I remember going to GameStop. Midnight release, right? Back in the... Back in the day. Even this game had a midnight release thing of... Go to GameStop. I had a can of Pringles. A case of Mountain Dew. I had Twizzlers. Like, I was fucking ready with the boys. The servers weren't, weren't good. Like, they they wouldn't work. And it, and it really, like, put a sour taste in this game for a long time. First strike. Oh, no, get up. I, I like to be back here in reach. Excuse me. Thank you. Hold on. I want my ghost. I want a halo. Controls to get into a vehicle in this game. I don't care what it's like. So like, it had a really fucking rough start, and you know, service didn't work. Nobody could play online. Nobody could do any of that shit on there. And what a fucking wraith. I just started and there's a fucking wraith? Interesting. Um, and we couldn't do it, and it was a lot of the trouble, of course. Uh, 
playing Halo for like 20 something years, bro. So what the fuck? There we go. So we we had that. That was the thing. And we didn't have Halo Reach in it, and ODST came later. But I got ah, a okay. mount up. And but Bastion Collection, a lot of people we had new Xbox generations happening. We had all this stuff happening, and we were able to take it. We were able to replay our games, and that's what everybody loved about the Master Chief Collection. It wasn't the Kill the speed. Thank you, thank you. Double kill. Excuse me. Thank you. Bye. Double kill. So. Outstanding. Be a pain in the ass more than I thought. There we go. So I tried to think here. When did when did when did this game come out? I'm a fucking professional as always, right? Let's see here. What do we Master Chief Collection release date? Let's take a look at this. Because uh, you know, and, and for that it put uh, 2019. Wow, Jesus! So, uh, uh, so that was like you know five, six years ago. So we're looking at the uh, five, six years ago sort of thing. And oh, actually, yeah, six years ago. About, and so like uh, it, it's, it really did put that sour taste in our mouth. But I want to finish this this thought on here. But like we were able to get stuff out after that. They really gave us so much. They gave us so much in this game. They're like, oh, we fucked up. We the servers didn't work, and it took a while for us to do it, you know. And they were said, hey, you can do this. And then they added stuff. They added a lot in there. Uh, ah, guys. Vehicular manslaughter right. reinforcements. Right. And, and then they started giving us like all the options in there to customize for. We're actually gonna end this real quickly. They started to give us all these options. I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna show you guys. The Firefight was added later, and when Firefight came in, we we're all like, "Halo Reach, Firefight, fuck yeah!" And we all, we all remember playing ODST Firefight back in the day, you know. And what I liked about this too is it, it didn't give us Halo Five, right? It didn't, it didn't do any of that shit. But what this game gave us was something beautiful. It gave us like, you know, Infinite wasn't out. Infinite was doing its whole thing. We didn't have anything new in Halo. We didn't have the new Infinite drop. And even when Infinite dropped, like, there was no... Co you couldn't do the co-op co campaign. And, you know, look at look at the campaigns we have here. We have Reach. We have... It should be all completed on here, I was going to say. You know, we have 4, of course. We have, re uh, you know, ODST 3... Halo 2, uh, Halo uh, Combat Evolved. Uh, I should make it clear, too, we had the Anniversary Edition of Combat Evolved, but then we also had the Anniversary Edition of Halo 2. And that's what that's what really, I believe this game really gave us there. Gotta take a sip of coffee here. It's uh, Halo and Coffee. It's video games and coffee time in the morning. What it gave us, too, is like it gave us Combat Evolved Anniversary, but it also gives Halo 2 Anniversary. And when it gave us this... It was beautiful, like the cinema, the cinematics we've never had. They're, I, I still dare to say, Halo Two Anniversary cinematics are better than Halo Infinite cinematics. Man, they might be on par. I'm gonna think that actually, you know, what, I might, I might retract the statement. They're actually, they're pretty on par now. But it really reset the game of like, here's the cinematics of what we're looking for. I think Halo Five actually had some pretty good ones as well, and then. I think some of the cinematics were pretty good, but it, yeah, they're more the real time ones, so it was a little bit different for Infinite. But it gave us something, right? So it gave us a feeling that we had for the 360, because I believe it was the Xbox One was around this time, which you had to have the Xbox One to be able to play, you know, Halo Combat of All Anniversary. But 
I might be wrong on that. Correct me if I'm wrong in the chats or in the comments down below. But like, it, the way the way the menu set up, right? You know, player ID and shit for creating your own emblem for the colors. You know, avatars and I got Charlotte <laughs> uh, for doing all of this. All the unlockables that you can have. Spartan Squad, hey, hey. You know, all these unlockables for the nameplates and shit, too. You know, Infinite has a bunch of them. We didn't really have that. We hadn't had anything like that in a bit. You know, Reach gave us a huge amount of customization. And Void did a bit, but Reach really did. But it's a, this game allowed us to say, hey, here's the things you love. And we're going to add to it. I mean, you just saw in the beginning there, we have customs more Halo 3 type armor, but it was a new addition to it, right? That's fucking cool. They gave us more additions to games that we all grew up with. And it's really the way this even the menu set up, everything here, it's re it's so much this like respect for the fans and saying, Hey, here is what we're doing. And they did giant things, they realized, you know, they messed up for the first couple of years for it. And they, gave, they they really made, paid tribute. They gave us ODST. They gave us Reach in here. You know, and they gave us Reach Firefight. They gave us ODST Firefight. They gave us customization in there. Like, fucking crazy. You know, and it did it start rough, yes. But they slowly started to be like, here's all this. They gave us the campaigns in there. They gave us Forge for creative. You know, like, they gave us that. Videos. All right. Halo Infinite. Halo... F what? Ah. I was like, what the fuck? Nightfall. Infinite support. I did see a thing in here, by the way. Is it Halo Waypoint? Because Halo Waypoint used to be the shit back in the day. They would give you, like, Avatar, uh, Avatar awards. They would give you all this stuff. It's, it's crazy to me. Hold on, folks. What we're going to do here? We're going we're gonna to do a quick little game. Make an uh, Xbox party really quick. We're going to do a quick game. Social game. Blood fight. Oh, that's cool. Firefight? No. AVA team. Free for all, 4v4. I thought 8v8, am I wrong on that one, I think? Okay, it just was kind of weird on the button there. Alright, there we go. Let's try to see if we can get a game. Alright. What? Why? Games included in game category invalid. Please update the games included and try again. Alright, so we might not be able to do that. I know there was a lot of glitch shit too. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like playing that. Come on, because I kind of want to see us in there. All right, cool. I don't, all right, I don't know what the hell was going on there with that. But, you know, it really gave us a lot, and it made us feel like we were playing the older games again, is what I, I think Master Chief Collection really, really did. And I spent a lot of time with Spartan Squad in this game, too. Of course, we did an infinite, but for Master Chief Collection, like, we would just hop on and play games. Like we would go in a month and we'd figure out what games we want to play. You know, Forge was a thing. They started doing the custom maps as well. You could do custom games in this. You know, like Garbage Man and all the shit. Duck Hunt. That's the name of a couple. And then the customization again you could do in here and the play with these games. Like this 
while Master Chief Collection isn't going to get anything. They're going to do updates, obviously, to keep the game running, the servers up, and shit like that, too. They're not going to do anything big. And I built up to it, and the reason why is because they were saying it, it didn't make enough money. Because apparently the microtransactions were the reason why it was um, considered that. And that's wild to me. It was, and that's why they stop. I mean, Halo Infinite just raised their prices, too, for a lot of armor at the moment. This is a recording. And, I, I, and I'm flabbergasted by that, too. Okay, it says player found. Are we going to play? And while there has always been server issues and shit like that, too, but being able to play in any of the Halo games, like, that's a fucking dream for us, right? And I know everyone's on Infinite now and playing the Yap, uh, Yap Apocalypse, or what, Yap Yap and whatnot, but, like, and doing all the crazy banish shit in there, but, like, to be able to go back to the Covenant days, to be able to go back and replay your campaigns whenever you want, to just go in and just pop in a disc. I, I have this on disc. Uh, and to be able to, you know, go in and just play it is it, amazing to me. And it's remastered as well. So, uh, And there's been so much hard work by people in there, by the game designers, by everybody involved here. You know, very much to go back and remaster shit and then go back and update it and 4K it, even for Halo 3. That's that's impressive, and the update the campaign as well still, and fuck, and to do that and to give us all of this shit is just it's a it's a crazy thing to me. It's such a crazy thing. Holy shit! Finally, goddamn. I'm like there is other games I can want to play before I go to work. I don't know. It, it, I want you guys' opinions because I remember this as like a problem. Like, oh, okay, look at ooh. Ooh, the iconic forge map. Look at that. All right, cool. I have a feeling there's a lot of bots. <laughs> I have a feeling all the 117s are a lot of fucking bots. But again, I mean, for I, I like I've been playing Halo since Halo Three dropped. Like in the beginning, when like right before Halo Three dropped, that's when I've been playing Halo. It's a long fucking time, guys. We've seen it come and go and not have anything and shit. But... Oh, he's got the backpack on. Damn it. Oh, yeah, and you can get west. It, oh, yeah, and also to the customize your. Like, even in the multiplayer, you can have, like. Got a memory controls. <laughs> shit. Hold on, what's the controls again? And you can have like weapon skins and then skins on your vehicles. So then when you know you get in a vehicle, next thing you know, that shit fucking God damn this forge map. I always love this forge map. This uh Jenga. Jenga's where I really played a lot on this. I'm also remembering how tough Halo 3 is. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, I forgot how tough this is. Gain the lead. This is. I'm over here reminiscing about the. Alright, well, yeah, yeah, there we go. I was about to say, ah, that sounds about right. I haven't even got one fucking kill. God damn, I remember how much I suck. Alright. Wait, well. Oh, why red team is fucking quick? That doesn't sound good.
kidding me? Oh my god! <laughs> why? Why do I why do I suck so bad? Okay. I've got so many fucking assists in this goddamn game. I'm over here like reminiscing and having a great time, and then the game, everyone's like, fuck you. God. I forget how intense Halo 3 is. Forget the fucking controls. Come on. It's old red versus blue days. Ah, I love you. I am on a stricter time limit today because I do want to at least play a little bit more of the Suicide Squad game before heading off to work. All right, the time has come. Oh. Okay. Well, that sucks. So. I, honestly, guys, so like, I'm really gonna say, was Master Chief Collection a failure? No, I, I've seen people say it, was, it didn't, it failed, and shit like that. Fuck, it, it did not. It, 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 it okay, I'm gonna go hide. It did it. It did. So Where you going? Oh, he running. Oh, he running. Oh, that's what's kind of cool. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that warthog. The line green is good. We got an elite. Look at that. Playable elite, guys. Hey, a Master Chief Collection didn't fail. Master Chief Collection started her up. Damn, I thought I was... Ah, oh, fuck. I think I threw the wrong grenade. Hell yeah! Shit, I, I, every time I find a person, I'm fucking stubborn to find a goddamn person. Down below, guys, what did you think of the Master Chief Collection? Like, a failure, a not, what do you think about it? Because I really think they succeeded. And the, and the nice part about it is because, like, every Halo game that came before, Master Chief Collection can be popped in or opened up, or if you got it to the end of the phone, and you can just play it. And you know what it is? It's old Halo, man. Like every other hero, you just pop up and just play it, play around, play online. You know, and if the servers one day go down, they do. Yeah. I'm 
but in the climate, you still have the campaigns, you still have the forge, you still have all of that. You still have custom games you can download from me. It's all still there. And it's always all going to be there. So in the olden days of Halo, how everything was back in the day, I, I, I will I will fully admit, you know, times have changed. Halo and the online gaming community of what it once was. Let's go. This, this game allows you to play those days. And it allows you to say, hey, I want my childhood to play a little bit. I, you know, maybe I want to relive a little bit of teenage times. And that's what this game gives me. I may suck, but hey. Come on, guys. I got another game I'm trying to play here. And that's what's great about this game. And I'm, I'm going to cry because like, the amount of time I've been playing Halo with Spartan Squad when we were kids. I don't even as adults and shit like that. Going. I'm out of here. I oh, so that's my warthog. Game oh. oh shit. They hate it. I see me be right in there. The lead, hold the light. No. Fuck. I forgot how tough this is. We just need to stick him. We just need to stick him with a fucking grenade. Somebody somewhere get a goddamn fucking plasma grenade on him. for everything and doing your own the customization and like being able to do what you want to do and being able to like customize the colors on your own like doing all that like the freedom of it's really just amazing and just to have a little bit of that shit back it's always going to be great well I love infinite I loved infinite I really did you know the campaign was amazing online multiplayer is fun as fuck and they add a lot of cool, cool great things to it Jesus. These guys have been playing some, uh... Yeah, there was no way I was going to win. <laughs> there was there was no fucking way. No fucking way. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in for this little stroll down memory lane. And I look back and pay my respects to Halo the Master Chief Collection. Obviously not fucking dead. Um, if the servers ever go down, I'll probably do a live stream of us playing on the last year of the servers. If that's a thing, that's another 20 years from now at least. So this game, this game, I mean, Master Chief Collection allows you to be able to keep the old Halo games alive. It did its job. And it allows you to replay them with friends online. And it allows you to make new things. It allows you to customize new things. It allows you to go down memory lane. It's, it, Master Chief Collection did its job. So to everyone involved, the companies, all the multiple companies, all the multiple people involved, big bucket of win. Big bucket of win. 
Thanks, everybody, for tuning into this. And uh, if you guys enjoyed it, subscribe to more video game stuff on the channel, more paleo content as well, Comic Chronicle podcast, loads of content for you guys. Leave a like and comment down below your thoughts on the Master Chief Collection. And did it do its job? I think it did. Thank you very much, it did. And without further ado, folks, stay creative.